Alex, and today we're about to learn a life lesson. So get your notepads out because it's time to go study. Now I'm regretting not buying the other bag too. He totally should have. If my dad gave me his credit card, I would have. Yeah, and the gold one is so cute. Well, maybe I'll come back and get it before our New York trip. <laughs> Who cares, Jessica? Imagine being excited for someone else shopping. Couldn't be me, cause I'm petty like that. I don't care what you buy, I care what I buy. You just got a Louis Vuitton bag? That's cool, I guess. I almost malfunctioned there. I just got a brand new waifu statue, okay? You may think she's gonna collect dust. Now they don't, now they're a little dusty. Or okay, say they, they collect dust a little bit, but you know what, at least they look nice. You got a parking ticket. Again, how much is it? Oh. $54. Not bad. Not bad. My parents would kill me if I came home with that. Yeah, mine too. And you know this is a reserved spot, right? There's a $5 parking lot right across the street. Cynthia, do I look poor? <laughs> Clearly this sign is reserved for me. Who do you think it was reserved for? Also, if you're shopping at all these name brand places, I hardly doubt $54 is anything to, to be scared at. You spent you spent $1,200 on a bag and brought home a $54 ticket. How could you? This is gonna ruin us. I'm never gonna financially recover from this. And my feet are already hurting from shopping in heels all day. It's fine. I'll just use my dad's credit card to pay for it. He probably won't even notice. You got another parking ticket, Tasha. Not right now, mom. I'm in the middle of something important. You call online shopping important? Uh, yeah, what do you call it? Also, I'm like, hey, how many parking tickets does this girl get? She just not know what, take away her license by now. She clearly doesn't know how to drive. Parking isn't that hard. Granted, I wouldn't want to park across the street. No, not because my feet would hurt walking in heels, just because I'm chunky. I want the good spot, all right? Can you please just leave me alone? See, this is the problem. We spoiled you too much, and now- Dad, mom's acting crazy again. Can you please get her? Crazy? Asking you to not throw money out the window is crazy? Uh. Yeah, clearly the money is, is growing on trees somewhere. I don't know, I don't have a job. Daddy makes the money up here. Also, if you're using your parents' money to this extent, how could you be so mean to them? How do you not have like an ounce of respect for your parents if they're like literally buying you everything? Couldn't be me. Can you get mom out of my room, please? She's bothering me. She thinks me telling her to not waste so much money on shopping and parking tickets is bothering her. All right, sweetie, what did, what did I tell you about? bothering my sweet little angel. Looks like, looks like you, you didn't learn your lesson the first time, girl. <laughs> Don't worry, honey, I'll have her out of here in a few seconds. <laughs> she can't last one round with the champion. <laughs> Here with the right hook, man. I'm joking. I'm joking. Violence is never the option. We talk it out here like adults. The only thing I talk with is my fist. Da, 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 da. <laughs> she has no regard for money at all. We're rich. You guys own the hottest restaurant in town. Why are you acting like we're poor? You spoiled her too much. Alright, uh, we're gonna stop this right now. You you keep saying you're throwing we're rich in here. Me and your mom. You, actually, I don't know why I said me and your. I'm rich. You're the little freeloading leech that sucks the money literally out of me. When you say that, I'm rich. You're poor. I'm not. You are. I'm rich though. I, 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 I just want everyone to get those facts straight, all right? I'll pay for this last one. But if you get one more ticket, you're on your own. Thank you, Dad. You're the best. Of course he's the best. He gives you everything you want. What about the shopping? Are you going to say anything to Tasha about that? I don't know, Beth. Do I say anything about your shopping? You don't think I see the bags in the closet? The new shoes every day? How you gonna call her out? How you gonna be a snitch? Did I marry a snitch? I don't think so. But but seriously, daughter, g give me your cards. I'm cutting those bad boys up. Also, I don't think kids know how credit cards work. You can keep charging a credit card, but you have to pay it. It, it does, doesn't magically just be like, oh yeah, you're building credit. Yeah, 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 buy whatever you want. No, you, ha you have to pay it back. Try to cut down on the spending, okay, sweetheart? Of course, not a problem. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Dead special girl. <laughs> You're number one, number one. I called the store and they said that there's only one gold purse left in stock. They better not sell it. I'm sure it'd still be there. You don't have to drive so fast. Yeah, I think you should try slowing down. And risk someone else buying it? Not a chance. 
I need it for her trip. Really? You need that specific purse for your trip? Like that purse is gonna make your entire trip, like it's gonna help you on your trip? That's what you need it for? I, I, I'm trying to grasp the concept of you needing that purse for a trip. You don't need a bag for a trip. The bag doesn't make the trip. Your friends make the trip. It's coming from the heart. <laughs> A cop! I can't believe this is happening. I tried to warn you to slow down. Dude, the cop is coming to the car right now. Why do you need to call the store? To see if they can hold the bag for me. If someone else buys- Oh my gosh, I was speeding and there happens to be a cop. Why would he pull me over? I just don't understand. Doesn't he know I'm in a hurry to go buy a bag? No man, it doesn't matter how many speeding laws I break on the way there. What matters is I get the bag. I'm gonna get that bag. You better tell that cop to hurry up or like the baby says, let's go. telling the cop to hold on. The audacity. I make sure my glasses are clean, put on my nice and sounding ones. Hello, officer, how are you doing? <laughs> it's a beautiful day today. <laughs> hey, Jen, mind if I leave this here? Yeah, no worries. Thanks. Hey, Dad. Hey, sweetheart. One sec. You may want to try another pinch of salt. Want to try some? Hey, honey, hold on for a second. This is trash, you're fired. You're never gonna work in this state again. Get out. I don't care if you have a family of five, get out. I don't care who's gonna feed them or clothe them. I don't care, they're not my kids, all right? Look at my perfect child back there. She's an angel. She will never do anything to disappoint me, right, honey? See, never ever. Get out, you're fired. You're done here. You know how I've always talked about wanting to go to New York? Yeah. Well, my friends are planning a trip and I was wondering if you wouldn't mind paying for me to go? Did you ask your mom about it? Come on, Dad. You already know what she's gonna say. Can you please just make this happen for me? I probably already know what she's gonna say because your mom's the smart one in this relationship and she has better judgment than me. So whatever she says goes, her word is law. Just letting you know. You got another ticket? Mom, calm down. There's people around. We just spoke about this yesterday. And look, she got a speeding ticket today for $100. Why are you going through my stuff? Tasha. And that's not all. She also bought another bag, right after she said she'd stop spending so much. Yeah, but it's not even that expensive. You call $900 not that expensive? Oh, oh my heart. You spent $900 on that ugly looking bag. Oh, girl, I didn't raise you right. I'm gonna have to knock you a good one. <laughs> oh. Oh man, I know you're not smart because whoever ripped you off with that bag is smarter than you. Oh man. Also, $100 for a speeding ticket, I thought those were a lot a lot more expensive. I've never gotten a speeding ticket. Yeah, so there's that. Your mom's right. And I'm sorry, but I'm not paying for your trip to New York. New York? But Dad, my friends are going. Please. Well, you know, your friends are pretty lucky then because uh, clearly they're not getting speeding tickets. They're not spending $900 on bags or whatever. And also, this is all my doing? You're telling me because I spoil her and I let her get what she wants, this is all my doing? Probably right, I think this is all my doing. My bad here. I picked the big bouquet of oopsie daisies on this one. Listen, simple solution, make her return the bag. Then, not only does she have to work at the restaurant to pay off her speeding ticket, she just has to work at the restaurant. Cut her credit cards, get rid of them. Why does she even have credit cards? Sorry, kids don't need credit cards. I'm, I'm just saying, they don't. I, I learned a very hard lesson when I was younger and I had a credit card because I was like, whoa, it's not telling me I can't spend money. And then five minutes later, your mom comes in with the belt saying, why is there $500 worth of spending a Naruto merch? <sighs> it was not a fun night that night. It's gone too far. Give me my credit card back. No, please don't do this to me, Dad. How am I gonna pay for anything? The same way we all do, by working for it. You want me to work? You won't even have to look for a job. Most people's parents don't own their own business. Remind me how much I pay you guys. Uh, 20 bucks an hour? I pay you that much? Oh man, thank you for reminding me. You're going down to $10. Uh, what, what are you doing, $20 an hour, you're crazy. That's insane. No wonder I'm losing money. <laughs> you guys are robbing me. That was my daughter robbing me. You're all robbing me. All right, everyone, give me your credit card too. 
I'll pay you 18. And here, you can even start right now. There's absolutely no way I'm wearing that. Fine, then I guess you won't be buying anything anymore. Or going to New York. And don't think we forgot about the credit card. Are you serious? <sighs> Are you serious? <laughs> they reached in my Louis Vuitton bag. It's right next to my new iPhone and my, my designer makeup. Hold on, there's so much cool stuff in my bag, Dad. Look at this stuff, it's crazy. <laughs> Oh, this sucks. I hate having to work on an actual job. What do I look like, a peasant? You want me making bread or something? What are we even doing here? What happens? What, why are you handing me a chef's outfit? I, I ain't qualified to cook. Without her dad's credit card, Tasha finally has to work for everything she wants. She then has to clean dirty tables. She even has to take out the trash. <laughs> If I was at that table, I'm like, oh, you missed some trash. She's like, where? What? She'd be like, oh. I'd be like, you, oh. <laughs> Go jump in the trash behind the back. She finally starts to understand just how hard making money really is. And then a couple weeks later, Tasha gets a little surprise. Tasha realizes that working actually sucks. <laughs> She quits halfway and never learned her lesson. Oh, <laughs> perfect ending right there. <laughs> I want someone to not learn their lesson in one of these videos. I want them just to completely fail. Is that is that too much to ask for? Your first paycheck. Really? How much did I make? Eight hundred and ninety-seven dollars. Yeah, almost enough to buy another purse. Wow, I can't believe I did all that work just to be able to buy one purse. It means more when you have to earn it yourself. Wow, I can't believe I did all this work just to buy one purse, you know? When I could have easily used dad's credit card and bought multiple purses, but thank you guys for teaching me this lesson. I hate work. I'm gonna go ahead and this isn't even enough to get my New York trip, just so you know, just to go to New York and do all the things I want and at least need a couple thousand dollars, but thank you for teaching me this lesson nonetheless. You guys are great parents, I guess. Thank you. Is it okay if I use your credit card? Why? I'm gonna return all of it. I realize now that I don't need this, especially knowing how hard it was to make back all that money I spent. Maybe I could use the money to- I knew there was a catch. Girl, it's been weeks. You can't return that stuff. The damage is done. It's done, so you might as well keep the stuff. Just sell it, resell it, and make money by reselling stuff. They ain't gonna let you return that. It's over, it's past due. The due date's done. What I was going to say is we buy you guys tickets, you know, so that you both could come with me. You want us to come with you? Yeah. If you want to, that is. Are you kidding? We'd love to. Are you kidding? We'd love to go. But honey, we're not poor like you. We we already booked our tickets first class going to New York. We actually, we leave tomorrow. Did we not tell you this or, or what? My bad. That's my bad. I, I yet again picked another bouquet of oopsie things. I, I, I'm i a mess this week, crazy. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going. You're staying home and you're working. So I, I we could go back, see you on the next trip. Catch you on the flip side. The lesson was work for your things. You'll learn to appreciate them more, you know? Don't take the easy way out. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. Make sure you hit that like button and to subscribe and to turn on that little bell for notifications so you know when I go live or I post a new video. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye, you guys.